Hey, what is going on everyone? My name is Dopey and welcome back to another GTA 5 video here on my channel. And in this GTA 5 video, I'm going to show you guys how to make some cash easily without needing to do a lot of work in GTA 5 online to get that cash. So getting started, I am going to register as a CEO. I already have my friend in my session with me, which I recommend having someone help you out with these missions that you can do with your CEO. So I'm going to be doing the mission Hostile Takeover, which is a very dope mission to do in GTA Online. Now the VIP work is something I recommend for everyone in GTA 5 Online. And if you don't have a CEO, I recommend getting a friend with you, uh, asking a friend if he can help you, and do some missions right now in GTA Online. Now the mission says I have 28 minutes to complete. Now I'm not going to need that at all. I'm going to get the mission done in little to no time. Now I was pretty you know shocked when I seen how much I was getting paid to do these missions and so was my friend. We were both like wow in minutes we were making that kind of money that's pretty good in my opinion. Now you're not going to get paid millions to do these missions at all. I mean they are CEO missions, uh, VIP work. But these missions pay really well and I, I really do enjoy that. And the missions are pretty fun. I gotta give it to Rockstar. It's you know it's pretty fun to do these missions. I mean it can be kind of a grind but it is fun if you do have friends with you. So I got the package and my buddy's pretty much waiting for me in the ocean. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to him and then turn in the package by skydiving. I'm not gonna bother landing at all. I'm gonna get it done, get paid, and that's pretty much about it for this method, you guys. It's a very dope method to do in GTA Online right now. Now let me know down below in the comment section on what you guys think of doing your VIP work in GTA 5 online. Do you not like it or do you like it? But overall, it's not the cash that really bothers me. Uh, it's the online experience. I want to have fun. I want to have fun while I make cash in GTA online. If it gets too repetitive for me and there's not really a lot to do, I get bored. So I actually had a very good time doing these with my friend in GTA. I recommend everybody do their missions with their friends and actually have a good time in GTA. But we are turning in the package, so I will show you guys how much I made for a few minutes of work. Now, like I said earlier, you're not going to get millions for doing these missions in GTA Online. I got 35000 for a few minutes of work, you guys. That's not bad at all. Now, I always post the terabyte in my videos because the terabyte makes you a lot of cash and a lot of people don't really do these missions in GTA 5 online. Now, like the VIP work, the terabyte work is actually pretty fast as well. It takes only a few minutes in GTA 5 online to get paid. Now, we're going to be doing the robbery in progress. It's a very fun mission to do in GTA. Now, the whole point of the mission is to pretty much rob the robbers that are robbing a bank in GTA Online. Very simple. Now if you don't have a terabyte, your friend should, honestly. Um, it's been out for a while now, so if you want to do these missions, I recommend you know asking your friend for some help. Uh, and if not, find somebody that will actually help you in GTA Online. Go into free mode sessions and pretty much turn your mic on and just ask people if they want to do some missions in the terabyte and that you don't have one and someone should actually help you out in GTA Online. And if not, go down below in my comment section and let people know what system you're on and uh, that you don't have a terabyte. And maybe someone will actually comment down below and actually offer to help you out in GTA. I'll even be nice enough to, you know, pin one of your comments down below if you do need help in GTA Online. So go ahead, go down below and uh, comment and be like, I don't have a terabyte, man, help me out. So now it's pretty much time to go to the bank and actually, you know, pretty much get our cash. Now, one thing I should mention in the video is that your buddy is getting the same amount of money as you are. So you're both getting the same cut for the same job. Now, it's not like doing the vehicle cargo because with the vehicle cargo, your buddy's not really getting anything for helping you sell your vehicles. So, and I'm pretty sure you guys all know how that goes. It doesn't pay very well for the associates inside your CEO. But overall, if you want your associates to get paid in GTA Online, then doing your terabyte missions will also pay them as well, and not just you. Because trust me, it's like putting in all that work for a little bit of pay, sourcing the vehicle, and then helping your friend sell the vehicle, and not getting any money in return for doing that work is... Uh, pretty irritating, to be honest with you. 
But however, let's get on with the pay and how much we made doing this mission in GTA Online. So just for a little bit of work in GTA 5 Online, we get paid for it. It's really that simple, you guys. 31k just for doing my terabyte missions with a friend. And we both get paid the same amount of money in GTA. Now we're also going to be doing some more VIP work and a solo session in GTA 5 Online. So in this video, we're going to be doing the asset recovery missions that you can do through your CEO. So right now we're going to go get the ATVs and pretty much turn them in for cash. But even if you are doing this in a solo session, it's still kind of rough because you have like three or four stars on you the entire time just for stealing two ATVs. It's kind of, you know, ridiculous, but you are getting paid, so uh, I really can't complain. But once you do have the vehicles, you can go ahead and turn them in for some cash and RP. Um, we have two of them right here in this video, but the cops are pretty hot. So I recommend watching out for them when you are turning in the ATVs. They can be kind of, you know, uh, irritating when they get in your way and run you, or run you over. Uh, it does get kind of irritating. But once you guys finally reach the location, it'll tell you to lose the cops, which isn't really hard at all. Uh, and then once you lose the cops, you can go ahead and turn in the uh, vehicles you are stealing. And uh, you'll gain cash for it. It's pretty dope in my opinion, and I totally recommend doing it in GTA if you guys absolutely have no money right now in GTA 5 online. So the pay wasn't bad, you guys. We get paid for a simple, easy money method in GTA. Um, and my buddy runs me over right here, which is, you know, uh, nice to know. So I hope if you watch this video, bro, that you are a loser. So anyway, we get 21k for doing the mission. Not bad. It only took a few minutes. Well, 26k. My bad. Only took a few minutes, and it was very easy, and I totally recommend doing this method if you are broke in GTA. Now, I wanted to add this in the video, uh, the Simeon vehicles that you can find around GTA 5 online. If you do find one, uh, you can turn it in for some extra cash as well. So right here, you can pretty much tell it is a Simeon vehicle, and if it says lose the cops, chances are it's probably for Simeon. So uh, if you do have that, um, go ahead and turn the vehicle in after you do lose the cops, and you'll get paid for it. So that's pretty much you know all that that is right there. Um, so once you have the vehicle, you can just turn it in, gain some cash, well, earn some cash, and, uh, that's pretty much about it. And then once you pretty much lose the cops, you're pretty much going to have to go to Los Santos Customs, and then just, uh, I think all you have to do is, like, change the color of the vehicle. Uh, that's pretty much about it. And then you're able to just take it to Simeon and then get some cash for it. It's really just that simple, you guys. But overall, it's just something I wanted to add to the video. Nothing really special. You're not going to gain a lot of cash for doing this, but you will gain some cash and RP for actually participating with the Simeon missions in GTA 5 Online. So uh, if you want to gain some cash and some RP, I recommend doing this in GTA Online right now. But that is pretty much going to be it for the video, you guys. My name is Dopey. Take care. God bless. And I should be seeing you guys in my next Grand Theft Auto 5 Online video. Take care. And God bless.